Yo, what's up everybody? How's it going? Today we're playing Dota 2, but vision is important. What I expected this mode to be is that we can't see anything, or like all of our vision is drastically reduced. And uh, as such, you know, kind of like wards or something are important. But no, turns out everybody has eyes on the forest, so we can just kind of like ward up the whole map, and everybody just kind of like sees everything, I guess. Uh, so in a way, it's like sort of similar? I don't know. Not really. Um, anyway, I'm playing Io because I thought it might be fun to like poke people with the ghosts or like the spirits um, if, you know, they, they can't see me. I don't know. Honestly, I just I just picked Io. I thought it might be funny to play some Io. I haven't played Io in a minute. I don't even know how the heroes played anymore. I'm going to play him as a carry because that's the only thing I know how to do. All right. But yeah, that's kind of the plan right now. We'll see how that goes, and we'll see what we can get done. We don't have enough mana to just spam ice in the forest, though, so that's going to be an immediate problem. <sighs> but that's okay. We'll grab ourselves an Agonims and then kind of go from there. Anyhow. Anyhow. We'll see how it goes, right? We'll see what we can get done. And, uh... Yeah. Just kind of get a few... A few last hits here, I guess. You know what Mickey and I started watching recently? We've been watching Community. And, um... I don't know if you guys have seen Community. I really... I like it quite a lot. We're currently on Season 2. Alright? I think it's quite funny. But... Something I have to say. So, here's kind of like the premise for community. It's a community college, right? And it's like a little group of misfits, and like... And, you know, like, they kind of, like, get onto, like, little mischievous adventures. Like, pretty standard, you know, kind of, like, comedy show kind of thing. Um, and that's really what I expected it to be. I just kind of expected it to be something like Pox and Rex. Or maybe, um... You know, like The Office, or, you know, those kind of shows. Like, even possibly, like, Always Sunny falls into that kind of general category of, you know, like, mostly harmless and mostly just kind of very straightforward. Um, oh, I should probably link up to you, right? Sorry, Mabi. Um, turns out... <laughs> that that's not really all that happens with it. Uh, instead, it starts going... Pretty wild, pretty damn quickly. <laughs> and uh, it just kind of like goes off the rails pretty much immediately. And I don't know, like what I found interesting about it is after like, I don't know, about half a season of season one, it stops kind of trying to even be realistic anymore. Right, there's just an episode where the whole school is zombies. Right? And they have they have an episode where everybody is playing in a paintball match, but it takes up the whole school, and it kind of becomes a war zone, and it's filmed like a war movie. And it's just kind of like, hmm. <laughs> you know, like, initially it was kind of like, oh, this is kind of like a special episode, but they kind of do a little bit of something wild. Um, but after a little while, you realize this is just what the show is. This just They just kind of like do a lot of weird stuff. All the time, and it's super meta, and there's really no... Like, Parks and Rex. While, of course, it's all a bit absurd and surreal, in the end, it is still supposed to be kind of how small government works, in a way. Right? It's still supposed to be kind of about that. While community is not about a community college... <laughs> It's more about kind of like, hey, here's a group of people in a community college, and now wild shit will happen. And I'm like, you know what? I'm actually kind of cool with that. Um, so yeah, overall, I think it's actually really fun, and I really like it. And I would definitely recommend it. Although it did definitely catch me off guard when it just immediately went way off the rails. Like, just... There were no rails. Like, there were a little bit of rails, but not for that long. <laughs> It was just, it, they were rails for long enough for you to get used to the characters, right? And during that period of time, it feels like, you know, it's like more of ground and more realistic. And then it just kind of like throws it all out of the window. Okay, then. But yeah, anyway, there's, there's that. Okay. I'm just kind of like farming here, you know? 
This is a very tame game mode today. Very tame. It's mostly just kind of like normal Dota, but we have a ton of vision. Uh, which I guess is kind of fun. Right? I don't really mind it too much. Like, I'm actually kind of up for something a little bit tamer like this. No, I'll just kind of like rush myself and Agonims and, and use that. And, uh, you know, try to level up quickly and become big. Oh, I'm probably just dead, right? Yeah, okay. That's fine. You know, if they bring in that much backup, then they'll just catch us. And, uh, yeah, I guess that's pretty much that. Dream Protector has it nice. Ice in the forest without needing Agonos. <laughs> it's kind of like a free, free little upgrade there in the early game. Because, uh, of course, Dream Protector's eyes are stronger than anybody else's because they extend his ultimate. Right? For everybody else, they don't extend their ultimate. Which is pretty cool. Alright, uh, we're probably not getting this. I don't know. I'm gonna just go and come in here. Mm, no? I really kind of expected the Spirit Breaker to charge in there, but guess not. Alright, thank you very much. Oh, crap. Ah, oh, there's the whole gang squad again. All right. Well, we are actually still alive, surprisingly enough. I'm gonna, I'm gonna teleport back to base really quick and try to heal up. Holy hell! Well, I'm glad I clicked that button when I did. I wasn't sure if it was gonna be needed, but it turned out it was. All right, we got Agonims. Yeah. Now things are starting to be really fun. I like the Iowa Agonims, I don't know. I just think it's kind of like a fun ability. So we'll grab ourselves some um, higher level of Teba. I think that's what we want to max out immediately. And then I'm just gonna chill here. So what do you buy next with Io? I mean, now that I have this. Do I just like get a heart? <laughs> it's probably not a bad idea, honestly. Oh, no. Oh, come on. Oh, that's not good. Alright, good, good, good. We're still alive. And, uh, well, now we can kind of just chill here with this and take down these fellas. Of course, we need level 20, so we get also plus 60 hero, hero spirit damage thingy. And then even past that point, level 25. But that's all quite a bit away still. Grab also these. What was that mode where five heroes rotate like I or Cobalt Commander? I think that was it. I think it was called Cobalt Commander, yeah. That was a funny game mode. It's kind of like we had some wild game modes over the years, haven't we? Just some really strange stuff. <laughs> but, uh... Yeah. You know something that I did recently? Somebody sent me this, like, sheet. This really handy, like, big PDF that was basically a list of all currently active game publishers. And super awesome, was super nice of them, right? Like, really helped me out because I genuinely used it. And I, I actually used it to get in touch with, like, quite a few publishers who then also, like, responded to me. And, you know, we're currently in correspondence and so... Anyway, um... But on that sheet, <laughs> there was a link to a Discord server. <laughs> and I was like, oh, I want to know what that's about. <laughs> so I joined. And now I'm in this Discord server that's just kind of like this, this business. Like, it's pretty large, though. So I don't think anybody ever questioned me being in there. And it's just kind of like, now I'm afraid to ask if I'm allowed to be in there. 
<laughs> so, uh... So there's that. I don't know. I don't really know why I'm telling you this. I just think it's kind of a little bit funny. Alright, I'm coming in. Easy life. Easy peasy. Look at that. Just kind of like cut him up really quick. Alright, go get him. I'm here to, to protect and to help and to be strong and powerful and heal it all. And it's just kind of like all around do the good stuff. You know how it goes. Where's everybody though? In the mid. Alright, into the mid we go. Hello, Mirana. Beat up! Very good. Look at how strong we are. You can help with the Dominant and Tether to a Sage here. Yeah, I know. I know that that's like the thing, but I don't really want to do it because I don't I don't like it as much. Like, I understand that that's a strategy. Like, I'm well aware of the Helm of Dominator thing. I just don't want to. I, I don't like it. So it kind of like feels kind of not fun to me. Alright, hello. Get him! Alright, we'll just get this guy done. Easy peasy. Oh! Well, that's bad. Alright, I'm gonna activate this bad boy. Teleport back. Uh, link up to you. And then in just about a second, have zero regrets when we get back in there. Yeah, beat him up. Beat him up. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Leave. Leave. <laughs> That's a Viva. We're not, not winning against that. <laughs> okay. Alright, got, I got it. I got it. I need help. I need help. I'm, I'm here. Let's do this. On the best aisle. Number one. World Wild. Beat him up. Beat him up. Nice. Oh, crap. Beat him up. Never mind. I'm leaving. <laughs> I need help. I need help. <laughs> Trying to stay alive, but it's just kind of difficult. Maybe I should get a, an Assault Cross or something now. I feel like some armor wouldn't be too bad. Alright, here we go. I'm coming. Oh, crap. <sighs> Gotta move along with it, right? So anyway, I need some armor now. But I'm, I'm happy to, like, go for some more kills. Like, there's a guy. We need vision against that. Yeah. Oh, well, you actually do have vision, don't you? All right. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Let's do it then. Oh yeah, they definitely have wards everywhere, right? They have ice in the forest. That's the whole point. This was a very bad idea. <laughs> That's the whole point of the game mode. They have ice in the forest all over the place. Um... Yeah, that was not very smart of us. That's okay. Uh, I mean, that, that's what happens sometimes, right? Sometimes you just uh, completely forget what game you're playing and then you, you get fucked up. Uh, but yeah, it is true that they just kind of know about everything. Uh, making things just ever so slightly scary. Alright, Gelsos, these, thank you very much. Maybe we should get boots. How are we feeling about boots? I personally am feeling that boots are not necessary. But then again, I am very wrong about that, usually. Um, yeah, I'm gonna try to keep you alive with this, but it's not enough at all. Um... Oh no. 
Oh no. Weaver. Oh, the Weaver does so much damage. Oh, that's that's just uh, a bit scary. But at least the Weaver has now died. So that's good. I will grab myself some boots. Kind of wish I had a hero like the Weaver on my team. Our team is not really the best if it comes to just general right click potential here. Which is a bit unfortunate. I got myself boots. Coming in. Yeah, honestly, at this point, it's more about survival than getting a kill, I think. Sorry. Maybe it would have been better if I had just let you stick in there. I don't know. But it seems we're getting this, this particular kill anyway. Cool. Hey, overall, that's looking pretty solid. Uh, get this. Thank you very much. Plate mail. Good, good, good. All right. And we'll get, I think, the extra range. Because that does, wow. That's a lot of range, isn't it? That's kind of wild. Oh, wow, he already did. Okay. Well, that's bad. I'm going to try to get out of there. Ah. Oh, close. Well, at least the Viva is dead, too. It's just kind of scary that the... You know, Spurbreaker is usually supposed to be kind of like a, a big, strong hero. And he's... Kind of getting run over. Do you have any thoughts on Spiel Digital? You know, I don't know. I have... A, like, so something that's kind of funny. So in case you don't know what the Spiel is. The Spiel is kind of like the biggest board game um, convention. Right? And it's sort of like the Gamescom or like E3, but for board games. And... Uh, I kind of have an idea for a thing. And uh, I don't know if I want to like pitch it to anyone. <laughs> so when I was like kind of like having the meetings with the with the video game publishers, right? I also kind of after so with some of them, you know, I saw oh you guys do do board games as well. Well, I have an idea for one. <laughs> I have a thing. I don't know if anybody's interested. Um Uh, okay. Oh, that's not great. Get away, get away, get away, get away. Oh, never mind. Alright, I guess we're going in. Would have been a lot smarter to just run away. Why am I missing? Damn it, I'm just trying to heal. Alright, overall, actually working out decently well for us. Don't have to time and finish karma. I know, I know, I know. It's it wouldn't be for now anyway. Like this isn't this isn't a project for right now. It's more like an idea for a future project eventually, TM. Right? But just because I'm working on something right now doesn't mean I can't, you know, like at least think about something in the future as well. Oh crap, there we go. Get him? Oh, yeah. Nice. Game is hard, dude. Game is hard. Still only level 16. You know, it would be nice to get ourselves up to... At least 20. Our spirits do a lot more damage at that point. But... Alright. Let's 
so just gonna go ahead and take a little bit of time to take down these creeps yeah I mean there we just have a lot of vision all right coming in thank you very much oh look at how fast we are Poggers. Dude, I'm trying so hard to keep this guy alive, but it's just not good enough. I don't know. This is just a very squishy spur breaker. Not really sure what to do about that. Okay. Are we leaving? All right, there's the healing. All right, got him out. That's pretty clutch. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna go in there on my own. Yeah, they have vision. Okay. Okay. We're still, still looking good. Whew. Look at that. Still alive. That's kind of nice. Yeah, the healing this provides is really not super impressive. I got 112 health region right now. Alright, pupils, gift. Oh, that would be nice. Wait, is it? No. I would rather have just some HP. I don't really need secondary stats. Um, what should we buy? What are you guys thinking sounds good? I kind of feel like magic resistance is not a bad idea. They actually have a lot of magic damage. I don't know. Maybe just like a casual cloak or something like that. Not, not too much. But like a little bit. Just to make sure we have something. Aeon Disc. I don't know. I don't really want to have something that defensive. I, I'm... You know, in a way, we're going to need my... Uh, my carry power, eventually. I think we want to get some sort of right-click. But... Uh, of course, that's kind of difficult as well very uh, kind of rough here all right get ourselves this nice tower down just kind of working on um oh nice good dodge Oh, wow. Crap, dude. Just get away. Just get away. Yeah. Y'all gotta learn to abandon the IO, everyone. Alright, you gotta get out of there. If you just sit... Not a good idea, man. What do we get next here? Almost level 20, so that's where our damage goes up by quite a bit. I mean, I have a lot of armor. What kills me? It's still all magic. Yeah, you know what? Why don't we actually just get this? Why don't we just build a pipe? Whatever. I don't think anybody has one yet, right? No, my team just doesn't care about magic damage. <laughs> so why don't we get ourselves a little bit of magic resistance, you know, just kind of... Double up on that a little bit. And, uh... It does also serve to just... Uh, provide us with some bonus power war. It's my birthday now, Pog. At least for me, 12 a.m. at the moment. Let's go, Rykweer. Happy birthday, Rykweer. Everybody say happy birthday to Rykweer. Alright, so extra spirits, hero damage. Relo re relocate cooldown is not really that useful for us, just because, uh, you know, we don't really have, like, 
too much use we're getting out of it. Although I guess we could use it to kind of like gank with, I guess, uh, with the invoker. Mark, we got a hex now. Your top tower is under attack. It's just scary. Alright, on the upside, we now deal a lot more damage with our spirit orbs. Got it. Very good. Oh, Requiem is very dead. <laughs> Not what I what I had hoped for. I'll be honest. Um. Whoo. <laughs> wow. The air damage output is very high. <laughs> very, very high. So here's our pipe of insight. Huh. Yeah, I kind of want to get some damage. Hmm. How can I keep my team alive? What if I get a Lotus Orb? That serves many purposes. First of all, it makes chat very happy. Secondly, uh, we can put that on the hero them. And also gives us armor. I don't know. I don't think we really have the luxury of getting to build a lot of... Um, a lot of damage this game. As much, as much as I would like that. Hey, I got that one. So I'm just gonna go ahead and grab myself a little bit more armor. Um... Wait. Did you just, like, break the link with me while we were teleporting? Well, at least I can save this guy now. <laughs> it's not a very good idea to just kind of break the link. Alright. I, I guess, you know, I wanted to get a kill, instead I saved the life. You know, I think I did good either way. And that's what really matters, right? So, is this nerd? Ah, oh, very annoying. Notus Orb. Man, that's a wild item. Alright, I know that's a Viva. Don't really appreciate it. I'm gonna go ahead and link up to this guy for a second. Provide some healing. Hey, look at us! Our defensive bastion. That's me. Alright. Hey, look at us. We got a bunch of kills. Viva, Zeus. Pretty much anybody that needs to die. No backdoor protection. Poggers. Let's go. Oh, there's the backdoor protection. Kind of late. So that's good news still. Okay, very good. Just activate that. Make sure we get maximum healing. 
And, uh, well, we got a barracks. I think that's really all we can hope for right now. And that way, I think we are pretty happy. I'm trying to keep this guy alive. Never mind. Link broke. Not because of anything I think I did. Oh, uh, I'm out of mana. Well, that's an unusual problem. I can't link up. Meteor hammer. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> Alright. Here's our link again. Nice. So now a fellow over here. Okay, very good, very good. Alright, power this up. We're still stuck in a slightly awkward spot here. But nothing we can't handle. Swap over with the link, make sure that we are healing everybody. Hey, Smurly Mango, thank you very much for the Twitch Prime. Appreciate it. Hey, I think overall, pretty solid. Can't really complain too much about it. Alright. I haven't really been planting too many trees, but, you know. Kind of need my mana. So, on that note, what are we buying next? Um, well, we can consume our Agonims. And then get some right-click. Uh, probably like just a Monkey King Ball, Lightnings or something. What's best, crits? Crits is the most damage, and I don't really think they have much evasion, if any. Oh, that is very rude. Oh, this time they're just going for me. Yeah. I think... <laughs> I think I may have earned myself some respect. I don't know. Uh, but they that was just straight to kill me. That was not to kill anybody else. Ah, damn. Okay. Link up with Rikui are here. Got that. Nice. Double kill. I think that was a good buyback. Nice. Get that cuddle. Oh. Very good. Now there's just a weaver. Ah, oh, that's unfortunate. That is unfortunate. The link broke. Very good. Hey. We're not really gonna get this right now, are we? This is, like, actually a pretty intense game, I think. Uh, so let's go ahead and consume this and get ourselves a Crystalus. I'm just gonna get some, some right-click. I, I don't know. I feel like on IO you can really do that. You just kind of, like, get yourself one right-click item and... And then you, you start with your link. You know, late game, of course, but... We are in the late game. We are almost level 25. So in that way, I think that's not too bad. Ooh, you're dead. Okay, we is what we're gonna do. We're gonna put that and then come here. And out we go. Alright. Alright, maybe not the best thing to do. <laughs> Ah. Uh. Hmm. I tried to kind of save us, but 
think it may have been um that's good. Alright. Ah, oh, Roshan. Oh no. Oh, get that? Yeah. Ooh. Way too greedy. I was way too greedy. Full magic damage characters. They just have a lot of damage in general. Like, honestly... Uh, no, they don't even have that much. They just have Zeus and Viva. Right? And just Zeus and Viva is way too much damage. <laughs> you don't even need anything else. You just need those two. You guys should really not be hanging out there. You'll just get killed. No, oh, now now you'll get extra killed. Because you don't even have BKB anymore. Okay. Oh, no. Hmm. All right. Oh no. Oh, that is a lot of damage. Oh no, that is a lot of damage. Everybody's dead. Oh, I think that's it. I don't think a single one of those connected. <laughs> yeah, honestly, towards the end there, uh, the big defining moment was really just... Or like the big defining thing was really just they, they had five heroes and they didn't. Right? They played as a team and we kind of played more as individuals. It's a shame we didn't even ever reach level 25. Well... Just how it goes sometimes. Alright, come on, just finish it. Here you go. Alright. You know what? I tried. Like, I know I'm not the best IO, but I gave it my best shot. Alright. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to leave a rating on the video. I definitely appreciate that. And I hope to see you guys tomorrow. Goodbye.